Uh, Joe, this is your first time on Cat Stars Countdown as a player. Yes. How do you think you're going to do? Badly. <laughs> because yeah. I'm not very good at spelling. I'm not very good at maths. <laughs> But you've been with Susie on numerous occasions. I have. Did but she I teach don't... you nothing? N well, she taught me lots, but it sort of hasn't stuck. <laughs> the reason I wanted to avoid Dictionary Corner is the last couple of times I've been in Dictionary Corner, clips of my performances have ended up on lad-based Facebook pages. <laughs> so, um, Lad Bible, mm. Uni Lad, Chav Lad. <laughs> and whilst I am an absolute lad, as you know, <laughs> Um, <laughs> more like a choking seal. <laughs> How do you do it? Well, I would sort of differentiate between the two oys. So ideally, you want a little pause. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> or a good one is that. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. There you go. Straight to Ibiza with you, young man. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, the last time you were in Dictionary Corner, you ended up on, on lads. Yeah, sort of and sites. Um, I consider myself to be quite laddy, but the people commenting on Chav Lad don't think I'm that laddy. Right. So basically, somebody that talks like me on Chav Lad gets the sort of response that you would get if you go to sort of a dinner party and say, What do you think of Brexit? and then <laughs> open a box of wasps. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to go under the radar. Have you got a mascot? This evening, Joe. Yes, I have. So one thing, um, every time I've been on this show, I always feel like that clock goes quickly, and I don't trust it. <laughs> but who I do trust is Pam St Clement. <laughs> <laughs> and I've, this is a clock that I have in my bedroom, and I trust it with my life. <laughs> so I'll be using Pam as the timer. <laughs> It's, rather than GMT, it's PST, Pam St Clement time. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realise how sort of cat-like she looked. When you yeah, I mean, at sort of at 25 to 6, she starts to look a little bit sort of French. <laughs> <laughs> John, have you got a mascot? Yes, well, I've checked the countdown <clears throat> rules, because um, obviously two unknown elements here. I didn't know how good you were going to be. There's no <laughs> rule against uh, receiving help from uh, the dead. So I've brought in a Ouija board. <laughs> and I just, just think what could possibly go wrong. So at various points tonight, I may go into a trance-like state. <laughs> and uh, hopefully we'll get a bit of action. It's got all the classic symbols on it, the letters, the numbers, the sun and the moon for when it's bedtime. <laughs> need a ghost to tell you and then when they're finished they're polite they just say goodbye the ghosts because <laughs> it takes a long time to spell cheerio i do have a mascot yes this is actually uh it cost me a lot of money on ebay um and this is some of the duchess of cambridge or um kate middleton as she then was mm -hmm. some of her toenail clippings <laughs> and there we go you see there's a little toenail clip 